Hey everybody, good morning. How are you today? I'm doing all right. What's I doing? Oh, okay, right, right, right. So I murdered the guards at the front gate uh, so I can get in there. Then it occurred to me, I'm walking around with like half a corpse in my inventory and a murder weapon. Ah, so chatty out here. Alright, well anyway. Where, where is the circus? There it is. Lucretius wanted a torso. So we'll hand that torso off and then we'll hop into Baldur's Gate and try to find where we solved the other murder mystery. Very well. Hello again, my vicious little warrior. Any luck finding dribbles? Not yet. I'd hurry if I were you. In this heat, things tend to go ripe rather quickly, if you catch my meaning. You mean this clown severed his torso? Is that not him? Is this some other clown severed torso? Part of Dribbles is used to create a gruesome art piece. We should continue searching for his body parts. We found his torso. Something dangerous has been placed inside toys donated for refugees. We should find them and quickly. I guess, I guess this clown's torso, not enough. I mean, like, fair enough, it's not a head. Sorry, I'm trying to eavesdrop on all these conversations. straight up have enemies over here. Confuses me for a member of I probably break his nose. Good boy. Really a crack oh kitty, kitty, calm down. Here. We got a plan to keep the kitty off my back today. I have cat. Over here, kitty.
A span of worms crossing. Welcome to Charis's caress, where the only thing that goes down easier than our drinks is our autographs. Wow. Look at me. Another drow for my feasting eyes. In darkness bred, yet no less delicious for it. Elegant, decadent, and oh so dangerous. I know your bliss. A sturdy dwarf, a leather whip, she gives, you receive. Or oh, have I misjudged you? Spot on. I thought as much. Those eyes tell a story. Punishment is your pleasure. It's fee on you, seek our stern librarian. She isn't here today, alas. Your penance must wait. Well, we've other ways to fill your void. A drink for one, a pair of drow for another. Choose your sin. Uh, let's see. Will the stern librarian be back tomorrow? Swishing. I'm no fortune teller. If I had a crystal ball, I promise I'd already have consulted it. Truth is, Fionn's gone well missing. And my hands may be skillful, but they were not made to turn every last stone she might be hiding behind. You need help? I can find her. To service is my calling, not to be served. Ugh. But I'd be a fool to say no. The girl kept my coffers near overflowing. Two flights up, then turn right and right again. That's Fionn's pleasure room, Elminster's library. Here, take the key. All right, that's that. So the very first b business we come to is a brothel, huh? We roll the despoiler. You can stare as much as you like. All right. There he is. Hey there. Another case closed. Another bottle open. Huzzah to Valeria! <laughs> Hang on a tick. I recognize that face. You were talking to Yanis after I left the temple. I bet she's put you up to something. You asked me to find Lorgan's real killer, seeing as you can't be bothered. Why must you busybodies insist on interrupting a perfectly good night? <sighs> I know that look. You remind me of Devella. Fine. If you doubt my conclusions, out with it. What have you found? Found the murder weapon. That's quite the discovery. Doesn't tell me everything, though. Why was Logan killed? Shape-shifting assassins under the temple. No. I want proof. If someone else killed Logan, I want you to tell me why they did it. Come back when you've got some real evidence. I wish I could kiss you better. You have I'm in case Isn't that. right. Really want to you put that murder weapon to good use. Not gonna lie. Enjoyed it. 
How many people are just hanging out on this brothel here? Archducal coronation. Don't mind if I do. Oh. Oh my. Tell me, am I beautiful? More than beautiful. You are the aurora stretched across the north skies. You are the golden dunes swept across the Kalim. You are the fruit of the forbidden palm. Soft on my skin, sweet on my tongue. You are my sin. And salvation. Excuse me. Your parasite stirs, and you gaze at the nymph through the flaming fist's hungry eyes. Your muscles shiver with her longing. Your skin burns with her heat. What's... What's wrong, Jara? What are you... Wait. I know you. Hmm. Looks fun. Mind if I join? I most certainly do. Jara is the most valued. Your face. The Absolute has shown me. Jara, what's going on? Who's this woman? Gather. Prepare. Behold. Your head screams in agony. The change has come. Pustules boiling beneath your skin, your bones twisting, your flesh rupturing. And suddenly, silence. What's happening? You should leave. Let's see. Crown of Madness? I should have set you on fire before I walked here. Alright. Have the giggles. Never a dull moment. You want to have giggles? Fall have face punches. No need to try too hard. Still on my feet. Pew. Still alive. So that's progress. Ah, oh, she was going to propose. Seems like a good moment to talk. Hells. I'd heard tales of mind flayers. Talons sharp as daggers and tentacles yet more fearsome but no tail did justice to its ethereal beauty it floats like a butterfly its blood shimmers like silver
They are beautiful indeed. Is it not in the Elithid's barbarity that we find its splendor? Your eyes are no less monstrous, I assure you. A lesser woman might be frightened, but I am no lesser woman. I'm not like other girls. Your breath quickens and your heart skips a beat. The woman's senses are heightened and her fire stoked. The mind flare is no mere curiosity, but an object of desire. Creature aroused you. Why should I deny it? My urge is as natural as the grape upon the vine. But perhaps there are other flavors that might satisfy my palate. No thanks. <laughs> Not sex. Something far more intoxicating. Rapture. Close your eyes. And listen. All right. You see only darkness. Her voice shines through it, warmer than the sun, yet cooler than night. The all being. Here, there is no suffering. Here, you want for nothing. Here, you are anything. You have one word. Tell me, what will you be? Potato. Oh, I'm going to be revered. You are more than revered. You are worshipped. An epic sung by the bards. A legend known to the scholars. A god among mortals. When the hosts of the plains raise their voices in harmony, it is your name they sing, and your grace they seek. Your flesh shivers, your heart bursts. True ecstasy for one fleeting moment. Open your eyes. I remember you, and you'll remember me. Okay, thanks. 1d6 bonus to attack rolls, ability checks, and saving throws. I will never sleep again. What do we got? Ooh, a sexy hat. The easy path. You when you've met the drought. Oh, I think I went in the wrong room. This, yeah, this looks like a library. Fion's journal. He's getting worse. The whispers, the night terrors, the blood. I know he's hiding something. And the others in the flop house know it too. I've seen how they look at him, how they look at me. They're scared of him, and I can't blame them. I am too. Who's he? Rules of the reading room. Anyone caught pleasuring themselves in the library will be tethered to the bookcase of chained books. Any wizard caught examining the special collection without express permission will be condemned to read aloud to the whole library the passage they were enjoying. Anyone breaking the silence of the lap library will be promptly gagged. All right, hang on. Let's see. Strapped choker leather ensemble.
green flare. Uh, yeah, let's get the leather one. Clearly, this goes to Monk. No time to rest. Where did it land? There it is. Yeah, it looks about right. Is that blood? No, never mind. Swift as my feet can carry me. What am I even doing up here? Like there's a ladder up here. I feel like there would be a reason to be up here. I could hop over to the next building. Let's check out the next building over. 